in three, two, one. Hi, I'm Chilton Webb, and this is Glycon. Glycon is a motion capture platform for your Windows Mixed Reality, Oculus Quest, HTC Vive, basically any kind of VR headset or setup you've got. And it turns that into motion capture data that you can then take into Blender or Unreal or Maya or Cinema 4D or Lightwave or Modo or, um, uh, what is it, Un Unreal, did I say that one? Unity, basically any kind of 3D environment that takes FBX or BVH files, right? And today I want to show you something really cool. You might have already figured out what it is. You might have. It's finger tracking. Take a look. This is with the Oculus Quest, and I am doing live finger tracking. This is amazing. If you have ever had to animate hands, like picking something up, or putting something down, or pushing a button, or um, typing, or, you know, um, giving someone a gesture, <laughs> um, you understand exactly why this is so damn amazing, because this really does change things. Um, so finger tracking now works on the Oculus Quest, and all you have to do is basically put on your Oculus Quest and activate finger tracking, and look at that. You got finger tracking. So this version is going out to all of my Oculus Quest users tonight. I cannot tell you how happy I am to finally have thumb tracking working right. I've spent literally a month staring at my thumbs and fingers trying to figure out the math for this because um, the Oculus system is actually slightly different than the, uh, than the Mixamo system that um, this bot, this particular sleeve, if you're an Altered Carbon fan, uh, is based on. So this version is going out immediately to all of my Oculus Quest users uh, who signed up for the Quest version and all of my uh, pro users and all of my elite users. And then um, uh, the next thing I'm going to do is basically throw this sleeve away. We're going to get a whole new avatar that has even better fingers uh, and, and thumbs for finger tracking. And uh, that's going into a, a, a version probably over the weekend. And then I'm going to hit the um, HTC Vive uh, issues. I've got a few things there. It's got some finger tracking issues. It's got a whole new setup that basically you, you do a T pose and, um, and it instantly tracks the rest of your body and figures it all out. It's really cool. Almost done with that. But like I said, I spent a month and I get really, um, tunnel vision on, on projects. And, and so I spent literally a month trying to figure out this finger tracking stuff. And it turns out part of it is, uh, is actually that the skeleton is not fantastic in this model. So that's all going to go away over the weekend. But everyone who is a Quest Pro or Elite user will get this version immediately so you can start doing finger tracking and put that into your projects and your movies and your animations and stuff because I know a lot of you guys uh, are waiting for this. And I can't tell you how cool, how cool it is and how much time it will save you. It is amazing. All right, so for more information or to get your own copy of, um, of Glycon, go to glycon3d.com and check it out. Yeah, I've got a few. I got a few additional uh, things. I'm gonna. I'm. I'm gonna try to get in uh, very soon. We've got a whole new little avatar system that will allow me to more more uh, uh, rapidly get these updates out and to also control things like um, what happens when tracking is lost. And so, like right now on the quest, if you move your hands too far out of the side, uh, they they go. They kind of reset. And that's not fantastic. So I've got a system that will fix that. Um, but th that's probably going to go out uh, over the weekend, that version. So anyway, um, glycon3d.com. Please uh, keep in touch. Let me know what you're doing. Let me know what you're up to. If you're getting bored, uh, let me know if you got any cool new animations for me to check out. I love seeing that stuff. Uh, any cool new games. I love seeing that stuff too. Send me what you got, man. I will talk to you guys later. Thanks. Bye. Can I do it? Yeah, there we go. Uh, nice. And I don't know if I can say the phrase. I get the feeling that might be like trademarked or something. Yeah. Okay. See you guys later. <laughs>